when I was a kid, I went through a phase in my life where I was too generous. I was always told that I was too nice and people would always take advantage of me. So this made me go into a phase where I was just mean. I wasn't generous. I wasn't nice at all. And I realized that I wasn't getting the reaction from people that I wanted. So I returned right back to my generous ways, my kind ways. And what I learned was that if you're generous the right way, generosity always comes back around. It may seem like people are taking advantage of you, but when you're nice and kind to people, it has a way of returning itself. Generosity is doing for others without expecting anything in return. Um, some examples of generosity, a lot of times people think that it's monetary. And yes, doing something like paying for someone's groceries, that is a generous thing to do. But generosity can also be shown with time. You can also give your time to people. For example, you could help a classmate with an assignment or with material because they don't get it or understand it as well as you do. And this is a great quality for leaders to have because when people see that leaders, when people see that someone is generous and is able to do for others without expecting things in return, they're more likely to follow them. That person is all of a sudden more that much more trustworthy. One of the main keys to being generous is to be aware of the needs of the people around you. I try to do this wherever I go. Whenever I'm out in public, I, I make sure that I'm aware of what's going on around me. For example, one time I was in McDonald's and the guy in front of me I mean, he was dirty. He looked like, you know, he had had a rough day, pretty much. So he ordered his food, and when the girl at the counter started or gave him his total, I saw him counting change in his hand. Um, I quickly noticed that he wasn't going to have enough money to pay for his food. So I stepped up, and I told the lady, it's fine. I got it. Um, I paid for his food that day. And... and I didn't get anything in return, but it gave me this warm feeling inside. It made me feel like I was helping someone who needed help. Now, I know a lot of times it seems like being generous isn't as easy as people try to make it seem. But the main key, like I stated previously, is to be mindful of the people around you. Too many times while we're out in public, we have our head down, so we're in our phone. When you're out, try to put your phone in your pocket and pay attention around you. You'll notice that there's people everywhere that need help. And and start small. You don't necessarily have to go and donate a hundred dollars or you know a thousand dollars to somebody. Start off with giving your time. If you see a man on the side of the road and he's hungry, don't just hand him a dollar. Take the time and go and buy him some food. At the end of the day, generosity is its own reward. Pay attention to the people around you and start small. And remember, what goes around comes around. And whether you believe in that saying or not, why tempt it? Wouldn't you rather be on the good side than the bad side?